Hello everyone and we are here to give you some super review after the preliminary show. I'm here with... Hey Adam G. Adam Hinato all the way from Manila, Philippines. Dave Anna Finley, also known as The Sovereign. And I'm Brian Javier, pageant analyst, YouTuber. And I'm Keith Williams, Mr. Supranational United States 2022. And I'm Sofia Costa, Supranational Miss Supranational United States 2022. Cool. All right, let's get it going. Yeah, this is actually a really good group, so I'm excited to talk about them. So who wants to start? Let's start with in, in order, Arizona. Oh, I like her. She really has a strong stage presence. Yeah. I mean, she has a model walk. I love her body. I just love the con And she has got one of those beautiful faces. It that I agree with, yeah. Mm -hmm. Her face is stunning. You just you'll just be mesmerized. You know, I think she has some styling issues. I think that if we were to style her a different way, oh, yes. I think she would just elevate next level. I also think that I disagree with Adam, and I think she could have brought a lot more confidence. Mm -hmm. I was telling Devana, it's really weird that this group was way more confident in swimsuits. Oh yeah, the girls love to be in their swimwear. Yeah, and they were not as confident in their evening gown. And I think she is an example of that. I kind of saw maybe just hesitation. Um, and, and I think she has lots more potential. Uh, this is, I think, her first time competing. And I think that she could go way, way high. Her first timer, it's impressive. Um, yeah. I yeah. think one mistake that we all make, right? Um, maybe I'm wrong. But when we think about evening gown, it's not about being serious. and not, it's, it's the other way around. That is your face game has to be on. Because, I mean, when we're doing swimsuit, it's more like, you know, you get that chance to be to be bubbly and, and you know, kind of kind of like um, be more confident. Um, in an evening gown, yes, we have to walk slower and all of these, but a lot of the girls, I, I didn't have that face on game on connection with them. I would love to see more confidence in the evening gown. That's, that would be my only take. I would love to hear Keith's view on Arizona. So my view on Arizona, I liked her walk. Her walk seemed very balanced. That's one thing that will get me. If my walk can't catch, catch me, my attention, I kind of feel like it's not a done deal because it can be worked on. But I liked her walk. It was balanced. She knew where she was going and uh, the turns that she made and the engagement that she made with us on the end. I'm not sure if she looked at you guys, but like the eye contact and knowing when to look, where to look. I like that. Um, I don't know if maybe else? I think a little bit different because mm -hmm. I just see so much potential in her. Mm -hmm. She has mm -hmm. for sure. so much potential. Yeah, you are, I think you hit the nail on the head. Um, styling wise, definitely could elevate her a lot. Yeah. She has more confidence to give for sure. If this is her first time and this is what she's giving, she's, she has way more confidence mm -hmm. to push out. I think if she just had a little direction and training, she'll feel more confident because she'll know better what to do. Mm -hmm. What about uh, Arkansas? Arkansas is uh, another contestant that actually was a surprise in evening gown uh, instead of swimsuit. Uh, she was actually very, very well poised, mm -hmm. and I was kind of surprised. I wasn't expecting expecting yeah. it from her. I feel more energy from her when she was actually in her swimwear. Oh, for yeah. sure, she I was doing more all the extra more things. energy in her swimwear. But yeah, it won't fly in super. Fast. No, she was like doing bodies. overboard, mm -hmm. yeah. pulling her mm -hmm. hair and doing arm things, and yeah. it was too much for super national. Yeah, I like the confidence though. She's fun yeah, to watch. Yes. Confidence. Uh, then we have Iowa. Wow. Oh, Iowa? Oh that has a moment. Oh she has a moment. She stole, oh it. She stole it. She stole it. As soon as she stepped up. Icon. As soon as she stepped up. Icon. 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 Believe it or not, I heard, she told me, this is her first pageant. Mm -hmm. She's a model, but she's never done pageantry. And the iconic way that she performed, not only just in a swimsuit, but evening gap, yeah. control, mm -hmm. poise, The wow yes. was it. It's like she was born with it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay? Yes. It was just gifted from God, and I'm mesmerized by her. I absolutely adore this woman. Mm -hmm. Love her. Yeah. yeah. I, oh, I had connection. I felt the connection. Very captivating. Energy, uh, the confidence, mm -hmm. the voice. It was, uh, it was Commended the, attention. Kind of like a Sir. Not only that, if you guys saw the the super chat that I did with these girls, she was a standout. And between you guys, you know, just us four right here, um, 
she was really good. Like she yeah. was probably the standout in yes. the yes. super chat. She told about her story. She talked about, you know, her, her, her life in Jamaica and coming to the States. It was powerful. And one thing I look for in these girls, and I just got kind of like chills, I man. Um, I felt like this weird pressure in me because it is so nice to see that she is willing to share that story as an immigrant in the US. It's so important to highlight those stories. And I, she blew me away. And her performance, Incredible. like Devonna said, fire. Um, yeah, we're, we're raving about her performance, but she has to watch out for her styling. The, okay, the, yes. The yep. gown choice that she, the gown choice that she wore. I didn't like the shoes. I didn't like it. It was too <laughs> soft for her. You know what? And fierce look. You are correct. I am saying you are totally correct. Mm -hmm. But this girl could win at a paper bag. She's she's so good at. Walking. She wears everything yeah. well. well. Yeah, she can yeah. wear anything. And I mean, amazing. had she probably worn Arizona's dress, I could have. I could have probably caught it. It's 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 it has a fiercer look. Than, yeah. Then watch because that that style, that gown that she chose. Was she's, like, no, it's valid. She could definitely have a better oh, gown. She's worthy yeah. of something great. Yeah. So suggestion, find a new gown if you can, and I think that it will elevate. Let's talk a little bit about Louisiana. Uh, she was actually someone very surprising that girl she knows what she's doing like she yeah she has a really good energy i know she was like like we say she was feeling her oaks yeah every time she turned around and yeah like it was it was interesting to watch mm -hmm. yeah I'm, I'm surprised that she could walk but my main critic about her is that she needs to work on her facial transitions she was just giving me this look the whole time she's working her gown on stage I think she There's no variety. Things. Probably. There's no variety. She, he was, she was just looming like this. When you're stuck in your head, you make that one face and you don't come yeah. out of it. Because there was really good movements. Yeah, we were just talking about that. We were just talking about that. I understand that she might not have that um, enough uh, training on modeling because she's working for the military. So. No, but when she would do those turns, in her evening gown, when she would turn around, yeah. she had power there. Yes, she had, she had power there. there. Now stop and turn. So, yep, yeah. she had power. You gonna, so, you gonna look at me? Yeah. <laughs> Kudos to her though. Yeah. You know, another interesting contestant was Michigan. Her when she came out in the gown, the gown was super good. Mm -hmm. uh, she's a bubbly girl. I like her her energy. She is also someone that hasn't had a lot of uh, support from her family. She told us, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, I commend her. She she did a really good job, and she's someone that people should look up to because mm -hmm. she decided to do it no matter what, and she's here. I absolutely love this girl's energy. Like watching her, you can tell she wants to be there. She is having fun. She clearly researched what she should be doing on stage. The only notes that I would give her for is just technical training. We need to straighten those knees, fix the walk because the confidence and the fun and the energy is there. So honestly, technical training is all she needs. A positive point. She was one of the few, and that is probably my biggest note for all the girls. Connect with the judges. Yeah. A lot of these girls were not looking at us. She was actually one of them that was straight in your eyes, straight in your eyes, straight in your eyes, and I could see it. She was there to connect with everyone. And that is probably something she learned from watching stuff like she, like you said. Yes, she's researching, good girls. Now let's move on to Nebraska. I love her so so much. I mean, coming into coming into this competition, she's my she's my winner because I feel like she has a super prototype going for her. When the moment she enters the stage, that stage presence, it's imposing, and this is what you always the contestants have to always. Do that every time you want to get the judge's attention, especially if you want to get our attention right away. Give us something right away instead of you doing your action when you pose in the middle. She's working. She's delivering the moment she hits the stage. Yes. Yeah. I do wish she'd just have a little bit more fun. Her performance and her walk seems like it's been practiced. It's been rehearsed. It's a little bit too structured. Like... Have fun, move a little bit, smile, engage with us. I don't want to feel like yes. you're just performing in front of me. I want to see like a woman who's interested in what's happening around her and engaging the audience. And you know what's weird? When you see her in person, 
she has that personality. She has that personality. She's so playful. She's yes. she's I would say in your face in a good way, mm -hmm. but it's it she has a personality that stands out. If she just loosened up, she'd probably be fine. Easily one of my top four so girls. Oh. Always tell us have fun, right? Yes. Um, every single day at every single rehearsal that we had was just have fun. It's about you. It's your moment. So I think it's important that they keep that in mind uh, for the finals and that they just, you know, forget about the world. I know it's hard, but just have fun because it's your moment for me. Every time I hit the stage, I try to give my best because I think of, okay, this is my, my one last, last shot. <laughs> um, you're not going to go back again and redo. So um, just don't think about it. Just just be you. Let go of all your nerves and, and just have fun. Get that let the nurse become, you know, energy and confidence, um, you know, transform that into something good. I don't know so. if her seriousness can be equated to her hunger Maybe. in winning the yeah. crown. So that's why she's really, she's mm -hmm. really giving it. It's really interesting to see that she also has that girl next door kind of vibe, just like we were talking about the guys, uh, about one particular contestant. She also has that vibe of just girl next door, someone you want to get to know, maybe go get a drink with. Um, she has that vibe and I, and I enjoy it. I think, I think it's good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's talk about Nevada. Wow, that body. Oh my God, that girl's hips. I just saw her and I was like, ah, Coke bottle, yes. I was telling you earlier, girls pay to have her body. Mm. Yeah. Her body is insane. And I, I really like that there is a, trans a transition from when I saw her pictures initially and she does look way better in person too. Her styling has gotten a little better. I also like her styling. She chose a color oh, that will make her skin tone I stand out yellow. Yellow. I, I actually thought the gown was maybe a little bit too heavy. Like yeah. there was a little bit too much, um, but I love the color. Yellow is my favorite color, so I love the color, but I, I would also suggest a gown change for her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, even though I love the yellow. So maybe another gown in yellow. Her face, when you look at, it's so, gorgeous. she's gorgeous. Yeah, you can't help but stare at her. She's got a soft face that's, that could really be it for Supra as well. She needs to also just not overthink it. I think she she looked a little bit when she was walking, maybe an evening gown, maybe overthinking like, I gotta go here, I gotta go over there. And again, you gotta learn everything, let it go, apply it still, but let it go and do it natural. Yeah, next we have New York. Well, clearly somebody's had training, somebody practiced, definitely has confidence. She's another girl that she's very similar to Nebraska and that I would say, just have more fun, flirt and flaunt and flex all your happiness on us. I want engagement. I see that she's practiced a ton, but it helps to have those spontaneous moments every now and then too. I want to see that. Seems like the contestants that seem like they've practiced and rehearsed are the ones that need to have a little more fun. More fun. Yes. Yeah. You got the foundation, you got the structure, but have fun with it now. Yeah. Have fun. That's why I always say, grab, grab what you learned, put it in the back of your head, apply it, but have fun. Because oh, we yes. can tell. Yes. We could tell. Yes. Even when we didn't see people shaking when they were right in front of us, we could tell if they were having fun, if they were enjoying it. Mm -hmm. uh, and New York needs to do that. But something that uh, my point for her would be that sometimes she does facially kind of like a pucker with her lips, kind of just like a little pucker like, like that. Yeah. yeah, and it kind of it kind of distracts me. And she's such a beautiful girl that I don't think she needs to do that pucker up, so. Coming into the competition, I thought she and Nebraska were neck and neck with a title. But when I saw her earlier with her walk, she was just giving me one dimension for her swimsuit walk and prelims. Agreed. She, went, she, wasn't, um, she wasn't giving me a variety. I mean, her walk and swim, swimsuit was just the same for evening gown. But... So yeah, so she really has to switch it up. But make no mistake, that face yeah. has a queenly aura. Yes. So she just has to give something, give variety. It's like, okay, she was okay. overthinking, it was yeah. safe. There's no difference in her performance from swimwear to evening gown. She's just peddling the same performance and you can't do that. The judges will get bored. That has to be a difference. Yeah. Uh, you said she competed with you. I would love to know if you've seen like maybe a, a difference in her um yeah she competed with me um last year i think uh she she needs to bring up more energy and um the eye contact um it's there but just for for, for a couple seconds um 
and her walk, yeah, it's very similar to to when we competed last year. If you go back and watch the video, so um, like he said, she needs to do that switch and make sure that when you're doing swimsuit, give me something different for gown. Uh, but she is definitely a, a great uh, queen, a great competitor, um, and yeah, I mean, she can she can do this. She can. She has potential. She, she, she has, has potential, potential. Yeah. for for internationals. It's just those little things that she needs to. do. And unfortunately, we talk about potential, but we're so close to the international competition that you just have to be as right. close as ready as we can have it. Yeah, six weeks or yeah. five weeks. Oof, oh my God. Crazy. That's not time. Yeah. That's yeah. just time to pack. Literally. Right. Right. Yes, that's no Literally. time. Well, let's talk about, I think everyone's going to get excited on this one. Ohio. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and my me chest. Too, me too. And my chest. We, we, me and Devana tried not to talk during the judging, but there was a moment no. where we both looked at each I other, over at and we were like, <laughs> every we were all eyeballing each other she because she did. My yeah, class. she also yeah. did something that was so professional, and you could tell that you, uh, she, this is not a first timer. Clearly, absolutely not. But the thing is, I what I've known about this girl years prior. And the way that I've always seen her is very soft, very innocent, princess-like. So I'm coming here thinking she's going to deliver a very innocent-esque princessy performance, which really isn't going to fly for Supra. I did not expect to get here and see this woman perform in front of me like a fully-fledged professional international queen. I was floored. What sold me was when she kind of had, she did a turn and her, her gown was in front of her. So if you go in front of you, you're going to trip. But she knew that she had to go the opposite way. And that just shows you as a professional. Professional. Question. Did anybody see anything wrong with any aspect of either of her performances? No. I don't think so. I think the only point what, uh, that I would put is that I maybe wasn't the biggest fan of the gown. But she carried it she so it. well that, that you don't even care. wow that is high praised for not even to be able to pick out a flaw for this woman floored stunning I, I have no critiques let's talk about south carolina i'll start um i think she is a very interesting girl her walk is there's a walk there's there's definitely a walk there's a set walk for that she has and it's very good i do think that she's another one that was just overthinking and mm -hmm. maybe not a hundred percent there I think there was some type of disconnect because uh, I don't know. I thought she was going to perform really, really well. I and there's that, there's yeah. some disconnect kind of. Uh, she's another one that maybe overthink a little bit and would look and, and kind of like think, I have to go here, I have to go there, mm -hmm. I have to go here. And that maybe just pushed it back a little. It, it wasn't that good. That kind of makes me feel like maybe certain people didn't practice enough because if you've practiced enough, your performance is second nature. Yeah. You can do it in your sleep so you don't have to focus on it as much. But if you're so focused to where it's messing up other aspects of your performance, you haven't really practiced to the point of comfortability. You're not comfortable with yourself where you're overthinking every movement that you do. And I remember you were saying you were expecting more from her because we saw her and we were like, oh my God, she looks like a queen like she's got the body she's got the styling her gown was great i was ex i was expecting more from her yeah she's another one that just needs to have fun and it goes again for all the girls have fun we can tell that you're not having fun and it's not it's not coming across on stage so. the biggest lesson today yeah have yeah. fun guys okay, so we just spoke about all the girls and of course i have to ask top three for you guys top three Top three. Is it is it even in a dispute right now? I don't think it is. Because I don't, I don't think, think really anybody's is. fighting over Ohio. I think we all have her as yeah. like up there. I'd say Ohio, Iowa, and New York. Okay. Those are my top three. I love my Nebraska. I was gonna say Nebraska. I would throw Nebraska in there. Nebraska. To me, New New York and Nebraska are very similar. They're going yeah. neck and neck, but neither one of those girls, in my opinion, can touch Ohio or Iowa. The crown's going to one of them. They're, those those girls are leagues ahead of everybody else. You know, as much as I love Ohio, I think that we have to look at the the Supra brand, yeah. and I don't know if she necessarily fits that mold. I don't see her in strike, and it, and she doesn't strike me as the girl next door. And I feel like Nebraska does feel that. Yeah. And um, I'll mm -hmm. go ahead and reveal, New York was initially my favorite, mm -hmm. but now seeing Nebraska and being fully convinced, I think that she does have the mold for, for Supra. You know what, at the end of the day, I think that maybe we should watch the interviews and that will define, right. clearly we have not gotten to a point yet, but. 
A. I'm still caping for my vertically challenged queens. I support you. All right. I got my heels on too. It's fine. So guys, uh, stay, stay tuned. Uh, we're going to have a new queen very, very soon. I hope you guys enjoyed us. And uh, yeah, follow all of us on social media. And I hope you guys love this super chat review. And we will see you guys later. Yeah, good luck to all the girls. Remember, have fun. Have fun. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>